Hey everyone, getting down here, welcome back to the Fire Red Nuzlocke. And I guess just a warning, just in case you hear like, birds or wind or other sound of outside. My window's open, so yeah, I hope that's not bothersome if it ends up picking up on the mic. Pretty sure last time I recorded with my window open, it didn't pick up, so that shouldn't be too bad, but who knows. Yeah. <laughs> don't know why I left there. Still in the unit a bit, but it's only like, it's not even 30 yet, so it's not even time where I normally have coffee, so, yeah. So we're just going to keep going through Lavender Tower and let, just see how far we get with stuff. So, yeah. Eee, nope, new day, uh... Dolph, yeah. <laughs> I tried to go out move it in, yeah, no. <laughs> E. Well, I could do something, but no. There was a risk I was trying to take, but no. I was dumb. Dumb, 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 dumb. E. Is Doc good against... Well, I guess we'll see if... I don't know if Doc's good against ghosts, but... Okay, Doc's good against ghosts. Good thing to know. That'd be good for, um, Agatha. <laughs> Granted, that's assuming we get to her, but who knows, we've been doing pretty well. I mean, granted, this girl go to shit suddenly, and then I would have to spend a while re training up a whole new team, because I'm going, I'm doing the whole thing where I'm completely out of Pokemon, not when my, oh, I entire party dies. Huh, okay, we're healed, and I guess you're not a, uh, Ooh, the clearance tag, that's to keep our Pokemon in a way, so yeah, but... Hmm, yeah, New Day back in front. You... Hmm, yeah, you're not opponent. But you are... Zombies. Riveting thing to just spout. <laughs> Doing with ghosts, not zombies. This ain't no bear to live creepypasta. You and your slender pasta men. You slendy men. I don't even fucking know what I'm saying now. Or why I'm even saying that in a certain accent. <laughs> I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, sorry. I, I do not like having live puzzles, but I don't really do have much to say I about it. I guess I t could talk about wrestling stuff, like, uh, I guess, well, as you pro may or may not know, rest in peace, China. Yeah, I guess I could talk about that, the fact that China passed away. It is unfortunate, though, brought it up. I don't know why I brought it up in my brother-in-law when, because one of his friends was nearby, didn't know who she was, and he said, and the first thing he said was porn star. Yeah, for some reason, my brother law thinks of China as a porn star, not as a wrestler. That's kind of... I kind of wanted to punch him in the face, but no. I could not take my brother law he would kick my ass. Though most people could probably kick my ass. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, d definitely a butcher in China. Well, I wonder if they are going to address uh, her death on Monday, which I guess will be the past month, like the previous Monday by the time you hear this. I'm I'm just gonna say I'm recording this on like the sad like sad a um the twenty and the third so of April so yeah you can tell when uh this uh yeah how pretty much yeah I record these events obviously so <laughs> yeah she def if she goes in the Hall of Fame like you know if they do address her death and she goes in the Hall of Fame like. Next year, if some time in the coming years, still definitely deserve it. I mean, the first woman into the Royal Rumble, the first and only female Intercontinental Champion, like, you know, those are big deals. And of course, rumor has it that they, they were once considering making her the WWF Champion, which would have been interesting, but they didn't do it. Hmm. I don't remember who, like, what channel I followed I heard that from. I don't remember if it was What Culture or Brian Zane. Hmm. Which, if you're a wrestling fan, if you don't follow those channels, do so. They're, they're good. <laughs> mm. 
Yeah, just going to run away from these guys. Actually, yeah. You know what? Let's do I I swear. Yep, I have repels. Plenty, so you know what? Fuck you, wild ghosts. I'm just gonna fight the possessing ghosts. And I'm not gonna give you blood. <laughs> kind of surprised I actually stayed in the remake. Heh. <laughs> uh. Oh, I guess another thing that happened in wrestling, apparently, uh, Finn Balor lost the NXT Championship to Samoa Joe at a house show, of all things. Just, that's just weird to me, just the fact that a title can change hands on a house show. I mean, granted, I've never been to a house show, I've, I've been to two live Monday Night Raws, like, two to different times, I forget which years exactly, when they were in Connecticut. They're probably going to be connected this Monday, but I do not have money, so I won't be able to go. <laughs> mm. I do wish that they would come to Connecticut more, but hey, to be fair, it is Connecticut. So, yeah, even though Type W had courses located in Connecticut, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I mean, I'm just saying this, I would love it if, like, one year I would be, like, say, if it was, like, WrestleMania or Royal Rumble, that wouldn't happen. But I would just love that. <laughs> I don't know, maybe in the past there was a... They had a WrestleMania or a Rumble in Connecticut, I don't fucking know, but... If so, it was probably before I was into wrestling, if not even before I may have been born, I don't know. I mean, that's definitely a possibility when it comes to, like, WrestleMania. I mean, there's been 32 of them, not only 20. So there's 12 that I was to... that would, didn't even exist yet. Oh, well, I guess, uh... 11 since I am going to be 21 in July, but uh, that's beside the point. And I am specifically saying, you know, for Connecticut, because, you know, that's a that's that way I won't really need to leave the state. You know, I won't have to travel too far, so. Especially, yeah, like, say. Because let's just say if I decide, like if I had the money, I decided to uh, go to uh, the, to like WrestleMania 32, like, you know, let's travel back in time. That would have been money for a plane ticket, a hotel, well, of course the ticket to WrestleMania itself, and probably a, a cab or something because I can't drive. <laughs> I can't drive, I don't really have an anxiety too because I'm kind of nervous whenever I'm in a vehicle, but I won't go too much detail into that. But yeah, I don't know, I'm just rambling because, you know, I kind of do that while I play this. It's kind of my thing. I mean, what, do you want me to explain- Oh, rare candy. Do you want me to explain in game theory what's actually happening in the game? Uh, you're expecting too much of me. <laughs> you know, actually, come favor this is almost amazing to the fact that, uh, I'm actually still alive because, yeah, if you listen to my commentary, it almost feels like I'm not paying attention, but yet I am. Uh, I guess I could just go to multitasking or just throwing words out of my mouth or why do something else. I mean, I don't know, I, I don't really often rewatch what I say and whatnot, so who, who knows, maybe I could have said something horrible in one of these episodes and I realize it. Then. But anyways, I guess I will actually commentate. We're facing four dead Marowak, so it, I would I almost said yay, but no, that's sad. Boomerang, the you will not survive another one. No, 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 no. Super potion, yeah. Come on, Leah. Okay. I mean, the defense is low, but, I mean, let's just see how much rage it does, I mean, it is super effective, so... And... Oh, okay, one more blaze and leap would do it. And Aaliyah, I'm going to outspeed the male whack going down. Mm. Woo, there you go, we laid you to peace by beating the shit out of you, because that makes perfect sense. Yep, the ghost. 
That's very good. Mother, my spirit is calm. Yes, you calmed it down by being it up. That's apparently how you defeat ghosts. No, we still have time. We're going to take on at least this guy or see how far we can get before I have to cut and whatnot. <laughs> Blue by it. Hmm. Yeah, the <laughs> your Zubat is getting the fucked. Though to be fair, you're using a Zubat. I mean, sure, I have a Zubat, but I named him Roman Reigns for a reason because I have no plans to use him. I seriously, the only I've said it before, the only fucking way I'm going to be using Roman Reigns for Zubat is if literally every single other Pokemon I have is dead. Yeah. And yep, down goes the other Zubat. Ooh, a gold bat. Well, that's more interesting. And, but let's just see. Okay, you got to survive a confusion. So yeah, congratulations. You're not complete trash. <laughs> but you still lose. Yeah, you're not Team Rocket. You're Team Trash. I mean, Team Rock has a lot of poison types, and Gabadors are poison types, so get a bunch of Gabadors and Trubbishes. That's fitting for you, Team Trash. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, oh god, I keep saying I don't know. I'm not going to bring this back, I'm not going to just try to stop it, but we're going to cut here. And we are back, going to continue being up more members of Team Trash. I don't know how long I'm going to keep that rain joke running. Probably for at least this episode. <laughs> because in like a probably like two weeks or so, you know, when I record the next one, I'll probably avoid boy forgotten this joke. But now it's a coughing, and yeah, I in between the cuts, I switch around Pokemon, so you know. And yep, down to a single Sonic Beam, down goes the coughing. I think, uh, what else is, uh, going on? Well, considering by the time this episode goes up, my, uh, review of the, uh, Pop Go Power Pop Goes reboot should be out. I wonder how that's going to be received, or if it's ever even going to be watched. I mean, my Story 420 review got almost no views. Got a spike of views on actual 420, but by spike, I mean, like, 20 more than it already had, so, yeah. I don't know, it's just... Hmm. I mean, these videos, like the Nuzlocke videos, are getting, like, no views. My reviews, like, sometimes struggle to get to, like, even to 50. Sometimes I wonder if it's worth it, but I'm going to keep trying not giving that well. I'm going to see, like, I don't know. I mean, I put a lot of effort and willpower into that, the upcoming Pop Goes, Goes Reboot. I really hope that, I really, I don't know. I'm just hoping people like it. Mm. And hopefully, even though that show is still a piece of shit, but, uh, that show sucks, but, I don't know, like, it seems that whenever I do something negative, some, there are some people, granted I guess it's whenever, if you criticize anything, who take you too seriously. Like, example, my Amazing World of Gumball review, like, the, of that, that's the laziest. There's this one guy, hey, who is angry at me for not liking the show, like, I never said that the show was bad, I just said that I didn't like it. Those are two different things. I mean, sure, I can see uh, why the show is good, but it's just, I don't care for it. Doesn't mean no one else can like it. Though, so, yeah, the pop up to review build is just so bad. And apparently, since I that episode, that video was like, 
read and edited and like, I did. When I did the episode, only seven episodes were out, and apparently it's gotten even worse. Like, they referenced the Magusta meme, which, congratulations, show you referenced something that's like, I don't even fucking know. I re you referenced something that I remember when I was in middle school, which, yeah, considering that I've been out of high school for like a year or two now, yeah. But, anyways, talking to Mr. Fuji, and also they had a huge era where the, by the club say a lot, said a line, but was the professor's voice, uh, not the professor's, <laughs> it was Blossom's line. <laughs> oh god, if by the club's mouth opened and the professor's voice come out, that would have been the worst. Like, that would have legitimately been the worst. And, let's, I'm gonna see, is there an aid up here? No, but do you give me some? But <laughs> still, oh God, I love that, and that's just the most hilarious thing. Like, if that legitimately happened, oh God. Oh no, I did not mean to talk to you again. Nope, nope. Go, go, nope. Okay. But hey, um, with that video done, well. I hit that at the end of it, and this is going to be- By the time this goes up, I'll be working on the video already, if not, like, editing it already, so, uh... My Grand Theft Ruby is coming up. Definitely looking forward to that, doing that. Had to rewatch the entire series in order to do it, but, hey, I'm not complaining. I mean, my Grand Theft is about shows I like, so if I have to rewatch something I like, I, that, I ain't got no problem with that. Yeah, Brian, but no Mick Ford can take care of this. Take care of this polywag. I didn't know what the Power Bucket review that I did have to move around my schedule, but like. Pretty much what. So, well, once again, by time. Well, I can't. Pretty much a. My next re re review is supposed to be a. Uh, the next episode, Cyber Six, so that's going to be after um, the Minecraft with Ruby, which, yeah, due to my favorite schedule, there's only going to be like three reviews in between the, the Cyber Six review and my next one, though. There is a rather multi large multi part countdown that's in between that as well, so it's going to be a while, but hmm, pretty much Cyber Six episode 5 and Cyber Six episode 6, there's going to be a long distance between them, so that's no big deal. Hmm. Because, well, you know, I've said before, I am determined to review the entire series of Cyber Six. I'm, I have four down and nine to go, so, yeah. Come through this raid like I, re you know, my first, well... Grand Theft started in late 2014, but, you know, 2015 I reviewed, uh, three episodes in this year review 3, so if I do like 3 uh, this raid, I should be done in like, what, 2019? Hmm, Jesus, I can't, 2019, that's 3 years, God, who knows if I even be still doing these reviews 3 years from now, well, I mean, by then I hope to at least get some of my, like, writing published. I mean, if I'm still doing reviews, great, but, if, I mean, I'm, I even, I mean, I barely have an audience now, so, mm. but I was just talking about earlier that I'm, I mean, I, I'm not thinking about quitting, but it's just like, there's just some days that I am just like, I'm not getting popular, like, uh, is it really worth it, but, hmm. The Fishing Fool with the Pokemon Kit, why would you call yourself the Fishing Fool? I don't know. I mean, and you only have a gold team. Oh, level 27, not bad, but uh. But McFoy could take care of it. And. Yep, down goes over point hit. And McFoy, who I didn't know is McFoy is that close, and. Yeah, <laughs> level 32. Oh, yeah, thank you, Fishing Fool, because. Or oh, Fisherman Hank. Damn it, Bubba. But anyway, suck. Fisherman Hank. Ah, uh, yeah. Finally. Mick Foley is going to be a Venusaur. So that means the only member of our party who can uh, still evolve at this point is uh, 
Neville. Sorry, I was forgetting his name. But, woo, Venusaur, yay! Go Venusaur, you're awesome! And, yeah, go ahead and switch everyone around because, you know, I do that. I probably could have saved time if I just switched Neville in front and just, but hey, I was already that far, so who cares? And, then, blah, 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 you're fishing, da, 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 don't care. And, Nibu. Yay! But, wing attack. I keep going down to Gus because I keep thinking that Gus is better, but it's not. And now you got. Oh, show the fuck now. Get out of there. Um, Dolph, you. Yeah, Dolph has an electric move. So, Dolph can take care of this. Wave. Let's see what the other goes in. Yes. Yeah. Oop, excuse me there. Sorry about that. <sighs> sorry for sorry yawning them. Definitely gonna get some coffee later. Maybe even go for a walk, it's a nice day. Mm. But you know I have to finish this up so first. <laughs> and skip down goes the gold dean. I don't give a crap about your goldfish. I mean, I'm believe some burgeon fish, so you are at disadvantage here and oh horsey. And uh, wing attack again. Then goes the horsey. And oh, <laughs> that we built what lasted quite a while. I forgot about Snorlax there, but going to face this cup. If she'll win, she'll marry her her boyfriend. Well, I got some bad news for ya. <laughs> oh god, I didn't intend it. Well, I did intend the accent, but I, I don't know, I kind of improv that. Well, I'm improving everything. I don't know what I'm fucking saying at this point. Hmm. Maybe I sh Nah. I mean, I might need someone way better in the future if I can't think of a name, but eh. You know, if I get a Pokemon, I can't think of a name that just instantly fits. So I don't know. I I forget if it's true, but you know, I believe there are rumors that Way Bear may be leaving WWE to pursue MMA. I mean, I haven't seen him on TV since he's got kicked out of the League of Nations, which is probably why they did that. I don't know. Has Way Bear been released by now? I don't know. And hey, if he does do that, well, good luck to you. Maybe you could pull a Pokemon and they come back, and they'll just promote like, oh, he's. Way better at an MMA guy, uh, I don't know. But, grin this here. Okay, let's do this. This may go poorly, but I mean, I'm definitely nervous because, you know, this is a level 30 Snorlax. <laughs> yeah. But, let's just see what happens. This could go well, but we you don't know, I don't know. And hey, if we do get the Snorlax, if we lose anyone, that's a good uh, replacement. Like, that's a great replacement. He's a great replacement for Dolph Ziggler if he falls. You know, good normal type. But, yeah, I'm just. I think I'm just going to keep blowing his accuracy because he's going to like sleep and whatnot. Oh, don't yawn. Don't you yawn at me. I'm already yawning, damn it. Those who've been listening, see <sighs> See, I'm already on it, so it's got the ooh, fuck, ooh, 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 
Yeah, yeah I, I, I need to heal first. No, I don't want what There's a super potion. But yeah, as I say, it's not like screwy placement. I mean, I get leave green and plug like while I was on vacation in Maine. You know, to pass the time or whatnot, then. Yeah, that, that went pretty well. Like, right, Snorlax was on my team. Its name was Tiny because, you know, yeah. Confirmed. I'm kind of trying to think. What was my. Yeah, my. Uh, this was like my Elite Four team because I did win that Nuzlocke. There, there was Tiny the Snorlax, Belmont the Venusaur, Bird Jesus the Pidgeot, Snowflame the Flareon. Vegeta the Primate, and uh, who was the last member? Jeez, I'm, who was the last member of my team? Uh, I, I think it may have been a lot of time, but it wasn't the Gyarados. No, it wasn't the Gyarados. Jeez, who the fuck was my last? the last point member of that team. Jeez, this is killing me and I feel bad. <laughs> no, not last person. Maybe it wasn't the water type. I'm just thinking of Pokemon that were on my team but died. Because now that I had like a there was a point where I had a Radicate, a Jigglypuff, a Pink a Baichu, but they all died at some point or another. Yeah. <sighs> this is really going to just kill me now. Guess what? Let me just remember. Tiny Belmont Snow Flame, Bird Jesus, Vegeta. Against no luck, but I don't need that. I'm just gonna just try a wing attack you. Yeah. Just stay asleep while I keep wing attacking you. That, that'd be fine. That'd be great if you did that. Sorry for the silence and lack of commentary, but yeah, in my mind, it's really killing me. I am trying to remember who was the last member of that one that block I did. Yeah. Come on, Great Ball. No, of course not. Hip up a miss, thank you, Sand Attacks. Eh, uh, Wayne Tech, but you're probably gonna fall asleep again soon, but might as well try. Yeah, you're on, you know what I mean? But do you know what? I'm going to try another great ball. Come on! One, two, three. Oh! Okay, that worked, and that went surprisingly well overall. So, yeah, there we go. So, if any of you fall, we have a good replacement here for you guys. And of course, this may be a very fresh, obvious name to name and move with this whole wrestling gimmick, but you know what? Fuck it. Well, well it's the big shot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that may have been the most obvious thing. Well, I guess the yeah, obvious thing would have been Andre, but eh. And I want to talk to you. Yep, stuff and the things and whatnot. I don't know.
Now you just give me a rod already. Yeah, but magic of the super we have a super rod now, which since Snorlax was a stag encounter, I can't catch something else here. Oh, and I did not want me to be in my Pokemon. Super rod. Da, 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 come on. Not even a level. Mm. Or just going to. You no, know, I'm going to register just to make this quickly because who knows, this could potentially take a while. Nope. Well, fine, let's try right here. And. Okay, there we go. What do we got? Oh, a horsey, okay. I have no problems with a horsey. Zapdos! The final member of my team was Zapdos. I finally remembered that it was named Shockmaster. And we, hey, we got the horsey while we said that, but yeah. Finally, it just it finally dawned on me, like, I mean, what's there legendary? Then yeah, Zapdos. <laughs> Sorry, Shockmaster. And it's a female horse. You know what? We don't have any, or at least I don't remember having any female names. Even that. So, yeah, I don't know why, I think because she was like one of the force, hip force f women, I think this would fit, and also because I can't remember how to spell Charlotte off the top of my head. So, Sasha Banks the horsey. So, yeah, because no luck's on the horsey this episode, not bad. Uh, and also, the make, make it now Venus or so. There's a lot of so yeah, this overall's not been, this has been a protective episode, I feel. And Rocker with How's your Rocker? He has electrical plugs for some rays. I don't know. Uh, nope. Neville, this is not for you. But the new day can take care of this. Ooh. Well, you're dead, Voltorb. And you're down you go. <laughs> and come on, what's next? What are you gonna throw at me? Oh, an Electro G. Okay, let's see if that does any better. Hmm. It may, it may not. Probably not, I don't know. Probably shouldn't get cocky because last time I did, my Rattata died. To youngster Joey and his top percent. 92 to 6, okay, this may not take you out. It didn't, but close. Who did you use, man? 92 to 6, okay, so repeat it. So, okay, you, you're dead. I like food. Now I just realized I could have, could have been probably shouldn't name it. Uh, whatever. 